January 25th. Leave room for God. But when it pleased God, Galatians 1.15, as workers for God, we have to learn to make room for God, to give God elbow room. We calculate and estimate and say this and that will happen. We forget to make room for God to come in as he chooses. Would we be surprised if God came into our meeting or into our preaching in a way we had never looked for him to come? Do not look for God to come in any particular way, but look for him. That is the only way to make room for him. Expect him to come, but do not expect him to come only in a certain way. However much we may know God, the great lesson to learn is that in any minute he may break in. We are apt to overlook this element of surprise, yet God never works in any other way. All of a sudden, God meets the life when it was the good pleasure of God. Keep your life so constant in its contact with God that his surprising power may break out on the right hand and on the left. Always be in a state of expectancy and see that you leave room for God to come in as he likes.